Hi everybody, in this tutorial I want to take a look at some of the image options that you have in your Gmail account, specifically how to add a profile image and also how to add a digital signature to any of your Gmail uh, emails that you send to people. So we're going to look at this in two parts. In the first part we're going to take a look at is the pro simple profile picture. So this would be for not only um, Google Chat when you have uh, chat contacts with people, but also for uh, Google Buzz account. And if that's linked up, then your profile picture would show up there. And any of the other uh, Google services that would use a profile, uh, or your profile, uh, it would pull that from this uh, setting. So go ahead and get logged into your Gmail, and then swing over to the Settings tab. When you're on the Settings tab, you've got a bunch of options here, and the one you're looking for is under gen the General tab, and specifically My Picture and then select a picture. With this option, you've got a couple areas where you can pull the picture from. It can be from my computer, Picasso web album, a web address URL, or if you wanted to remove the picture you have there, you can choose no picture. I'm going to go ahead and hit browse on my computer and look for a profile picture that I've already got saved. So there we are. You can double click that to open it. Resize this box to do any cropping or repositioning that might need to be done. And then click apply changes. Then you have the option visible to everyone or visible to only people I chat with. And then down towards the bottom, if you scroll all the way down, you can save the changes. So that's how you would do that. So you can always come back in here and, and change these options. Or to remove the picture, just click on that same change picture, choose no picture, and again, apply the changes. And you're all set. So to work with your uh, digital signature, however, is a little bit different. So just a little bit further down from my picture is the signature. And here you could add some text if you wanted to. You could put your name. You could put your website. Whatever you needed to do there. And then if you wanted to add an image in the simple browser that you have here, you have the little image, insert image icon. When you click that, the only disadvantage to working here is that you can't upload an image. You have to link to an image. So you need to find that image online or upload that to your website or a Facebook profile page or something like that and then link to it from there. So what I did was go ahead to our Facebook page, our group page, and browse to that image. Uh, that's our you know, kind of Facebook logo there. And actually right click on it and then chose copy image location, which is essentially going to give me the URL of that image. Swing back over to the Gmail and what I'm going to do is paste in that URL and you can see a preview of the image that's been added. And this can be any image that you can find a URL for. So literally anything you can find on your Flickr account, your Picasa account, or any uh, Shutterfly or uh, Snapfish picture that you can get a URL for, you can drop in here. And then you go ahead and hit OK. And you notice the logo is way too big for my digital signature. So when I click on the image to select it, Google conveniently allows me to resize it using medium small or large conventions as it has in its image searches. So I'm going to go ahead with medium because it still looks pretty good, but it also fits neatly within my digital signature. So then you would just proceed to the bottom of the page and hit save, and that would save that preference. If I go back to the settings tab, at the top you'll see now my digital signature is there, and it's turned on. If I ever wanted to disable that temporarily, I could choose no signature, but you'll notice that doesn't change the settings here. It doesn't wipe out my signature. It just temporarily disables it. And again, you'd have to return to the bottom of the page and hit save. So those are two simple ways to use Google uh, Gmail uh, images or images in your Gmail account for both your profile picture and also your uh, digital signature. So as long as you can find images online, you can add them to your Google profile. Thanks for watching.